So the newest releases for Crown Zenith are the Morpeko V Union Premium Playmat Collection and three pack blisters featuring Inteleon, Rillaboom, and Cinderace. So let's start out with the Morpeko V Union Premium Playmat Collection. And as you watch me struggle to open this box, don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment to let me know what else I can do better with these videos. So right off the bat, this is a playmat collection, so it does come with a playmat. Let's get this open and see what it looks like. So it does feature Marnie and Morpeko. Kind of hard to fit in the shot here. And it does have the Crown Zenith logo down there as well. So I don't know if you can really see it here, but I do um, think that this playmat's actually like thicker. <laughs> it's better quality than the Charizard one and the Radiant Eevee one that I've gotten before. So it's, a, it's heavy too, so it's a good quality playmat. All right, so we also have the jumbo version of the V Union card. Actually, this is kind of like the size it actually is, um, <laughs> if you were to play with it. This is, as far as I know, this is basically the same Morbeko V Union. Um, that was printed before, but it has a different art. Here is also the previous one. Actually, the, the, I'm not sure which one I like more, actually. I would be fine with either. I like the colors on this one more, actually. All right, and then we have the actual cards that you would use in game. You would discard these, and then um, I think you're able to recall them from the discard pile to make your V Union. And to aid in that, every V Union seems to come with Professor Burnett, which lets you Discard two cards uh, just from your deck. As well, this has come with five packs of Crown Zenith, so let's dig into those. All right, so let's start with the first pack. So I have pulled the Charizard uh, V and the Radiant Charizard from here, but I'm still missing the Charizard V star, so I'd hope to pull that sometime soon. We have Larvesta, Oddish, Seal, Potion, Arrowon, Rescue Carrier, Reverse Hollow, and Volcarona, Non Hollow. Pack number two. So I believe the release of these products does make it indeed the like longest set release window that they've had for any set, because um, this has gone on for like a few months now. But I'm curious to know if like these later packs will still have as many hits as before. Because there's always the talk of reprints always have less hits. Are these reprints or is it still the same print? I don't know. We have Baltoy, Glaring Meowth, Whalmer, Reverse Hollow Oddish, and Werelord Non Hollow. Pack number three. Now, I don't have any dreams of completing a master set for this one. Um, that would take a lot of packs, I think. But I do definitely still want to pull some stuff from the Galarian Gallery, most notably the the Mew and the Mewtwo. I think look fantastic, and I definitely want to add those to my collection. Uh, and I'm always looking to pull duplicate Charizards so I can have them in separate binders. All right, so we have Reverse Hollow Ditto and Gumshoes Not Hollow. All right, so we're three packs in. And we're going to start the fourth pack. So normally you're used to a lot of hits from Crown of the Earth, but there is occasionally you'll get a box that just does not do well. Uh, this is starting to look like one of those boxes, unless these last two packs have some good stuff in there. Helioptile, Pancham, Switch, Snow Run, Reverse Hollow Deoxys. All right, I don't think I have this one. Sorry, not Reverse Hollow, Glaring Gallery Deoxys, which is one of the ones I need, and Bead not uh, Bead Signature Card. All right, and to our last pack from this one. Now, I will be throwing up the prices for the cards. Um, I think right now the prices have currently tanked for Crown Zenith, as I understand. Um, at least that's the time of this recording. So maybe they're going back up now. We'll never know. Well, we'll see. We have Pokemon Catcher, I Sharp, Digging Duo, Wulu. Ah, maybe I see it in here. Not sure. Shinx, Pancham, Snow Runt. Ponyard, Deoxys V-Star, all right, Deoxys and Deoxys V-Star, both from Glaring Gallery and Glaring Berserker. All right, in reality, I'm I'm not mad at that box, not if I'm getting these two out of it, which I 
I both needed to complete my Galarian Gallery, uh, which I don't think will happen, but I'm happy with it. All right, now we have these three packed blisters, each with a pin uh, and a Black Star promo uh, version of Cinderace, Rillaboom, and Inteleon. Uh, as far as I know, these are not new cards, just different card arts, uh, and that's why they're Black Star promos. But let's start with Inteleon. So here is the pin you get for Inteleon. Here is the Black Star promo hollow. Quick shooting, so I mean, I think a lot of people like that card. And three packs as it was a three pack blister. So let's take in the first pack and see what we get. So now the question is, will these fare better than the Morpeko V Union? Uh, so I did get two hits out of that, both Glaring Gallery. And I'm hoping to get some more Glaring Gallery in here. Love Disc, Chadot, Yanma, Ponyard, Cricketot. All right, we have Glaring Gallery Puccina, which I, I, I in my head that, not sure. And Enamorous non Hollow. So this is one of the, um, nine cards that makes up a image when you add them together. I'm really not sure if I had the Puccina, but uh, I will check later and let you know. Pack number two. All right, we have Light Energy, Dusclops, Matang, Energy Switch, Whalmer, Shinx, Larvesta, Oddish, Seal, Deancey, Galarian Gallery, and Lycanroc non Hollow. Now this one I know I have, but again, it is a hit. So now the question is, can I get a hit in every pack? Probably not, I'm expecting nothing in here. We have Lightning Energy again. Crocorock, Lunatone, Solrock, Helioptile, Wooloo, Shinx, Pancham, Snow Runt, Reverse Hollow Ultra Ball, and Pangoro Non Hollow. All right, so that was two hits and three packs. Let's see if Rillaboom can match. So, like before, you get a pin, the Black Star promo, and three more packs. Let's start with the first one. Now, while the first one had two hits in three packs, it could very easily, this one has no hits in any of the packs, so it is a risk. We have Chadot, Yanma, Reverse Hollow Rockoff, and Heliolisk Non Hollow. On to pack number two. We have Fighting Energy, Laron, Friends and Sinnoh, Gloom, Scyther, Pokeball, Young Goose, Cherubi, Execute, Swab Blue from the Glaring Gallery, and Pangoro Non Hollow. Alright, the last pack of this three sleep blister before we move on to the last one. All right. All right, we got a V-Star marker, so that means it has obviously a Charizard V-Star in there, right? Let's find out. Lunatone, Tangela, Baltoy, Glaring Meowth, Whalmer, Shinx, Darkrai V-Star, all right, I'll take that, and Zero Aura V-Star, right, a double hitter. That, that means this is, at the moment, the best three-pack blister because it had three hits. So I think that Darkrai V-Star is currently the top card we pulled today. Let's see if the Cinderace 3 Sleeve Booster can make a difference here. So we have our pin. We have our Black Star promo. And another three packs. Pack number one.
we have Water Energy, Friends in Sinnoh, Bloom, Ultra Ball, Salandit, Energy Search, Grubbin, Skrelp, Hulu, Reverse Hollow Penetrin, and Luxray on Hollow, but at least I am missing this one. I, I've been trying to find this Luxray for a while, so I, you know, that's nice I'm going to finally get it. Our second to last pack of this opening. So I did spy a hit in here. Not sure what it is, uh, but it looks like Galarian Gallery, so let's see what we get. We have Rare Candy, Luxio, Electric, Salandit, Purloin, Grubbin, Skrelp, Helioptile, Energy Switch, maybe that's what I saw. Uh, and then we have Pangoran and Hollow, so <laughs> I saw nothing. Alright, so the Cinderace one has been the worst. Uh, it's all down to this last pack, so let's see if we can maybe pull a double hitter out or just some. Let's see if we end it on a big hit. Probably not. Let's see. We have Salazzle. Rare Candy, Dusclops, Cherubi, Execute, Energy Retrieval, Emolga, Love Disk, Reverse Hall of Pokemon Catcher, so nothing more for Glaren Gallery, and Oranguru non holo So as I've said before, with Crown Zenith, sometimes you can really hit, and sometimes you can really miss. Uh, which pretty much goes for any set of Pokemon cards. But thanks for watching this opening. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know how Crown Zines has been to you with these new products. Have the hit rates been good for you? Have they been better? Have they been worse? And I will see you on the next video.